This week, our focus of training for Percy has been steadiness. We've gone back to the garden to sit and wait and be patient, sowing the seeds that not every retrieve is his and everything that is around him is not his. He's a very high-driven dog for retrieving, so I'm using all of his favourite objects that he would be retrieving with normally to make him understand that not everything is his. I walk round him, collecting the items as I go. I don't give him much eye contact or speak to him during training and drills very often because this makes him more excited. So I keep everything very calm and very non-exciting with my body language. As I walk round, he is focusing on me and I pick up the items and then we take the following day out into the field. Again, I sit him up, I throw his favourite objects around and as you can see from the tail, they are extremely exciting for him. He sits very patiently and waits. I then recall him past the distractions and he leaves the distractions and comes straight back to my side on a perfect recall. The next day we then go out and again into a different environment. This environment he normally uses for hunting, so he's extremely excited. Again, I throw out the retrieves after blowing the stop whistle and making sure that he sits and waits and watches. He will get a retrieve at the end, but at the moment he has to sit and wait patiently. I walk round him, picking up the objects out of the grass. He is sitting very patiently. He doesn't move and we haven't got any squeaking. I then walk past him. I throw a dummy over his head, which will be his retrieve at the end of the drill. 